What's up, fan clan, and welcome back to the channel. Today is so freaking exciting. I'm up at the crack of dawn right now because... Hi. Good morning. Oh, sweepy head. Okay, slight interruption. We are surprising the kids today with the BUS. Derek and I are just so excited. Those that know, this is literally our dream, and so today is going to be... Epic. We are packing everything up now. Garrick's about to get venture because he's still sleeping. And we are about to head out. After we go, we do plan on going to the beach. We're having to travel a bit to get to where we're going. And we don't normally go to these beaches, so it's just a different Dad, beach what? to go to. Also, I don't think there's any beaches like where we live that you can drive onto. Yeah. Y'all don't even know what day it is. I already told them. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a brave case. <laughs> Are they heavy? Uh. Oh, that's not bad. This is just one solar panel? It's one. So we have three? Yeah. That's not bad. I was expecting them to be like 50 pounds. Oh, shoot. Before we go, can you grab my glasses, please? I forget I can actually like see the world now, so that's great. Wait, you can see the world now? I can see the world now because I have glasses. Without my glasses, I can't see very well. Oh, I thought you I can, but just not that good. It's a little fuzzy. We're up so early that Wilder brought his pillow and blanket in the car because he plans on taking a nap. Yeah? Okay, I'll get him. It's okay. Got it? I feel like a new woman being able to see. We just stopped for gas and more fuel from Chick-fil-A and we're right on schedule. I swear nothing could ruin my mood today. I am just so excited. I can't wait. I talked to you guys in the last video about how if it aligned, I'm gonna try to say what I need to say without little ears hearing, but the stars have aligned and the people that we were talking to before got back from their mission trip and they haven't sold it yet, so. We're going to the BUS. You got something way cooler than that Spider-Man. Venture, I got you a tiger shark and a killer whale. This is a marshmallow launcher. Marshmallow launcher. You can shoot marshmallows. Those type of toys are perfect for outdoor activities. Guys, guess what? You want to know where we're going? Wait. We're going to get our bus. Yay! Right now, dude, we're about to pull up! Yay! Yay! Wow. Yeah. Oh, yeah. see it. When she gets You can see it? Yeah! I can see it. Yeah! I'm so excited. Look at that thing. Oh, yeah! I know it's over there! It's really a surreal moment.
and not have to get in here all sandy. And how often the kids have to use the bathroom. Yeah, the kids were able to just shower off right here, use the bathroom there. Are you guys excited to bring the bus home? Yeah. We're here. We're here. So we made it home. Zoe drove it here. Just oh, kidding. I need to learn <laughs> how to do that though. Nice cup holder. I know, that is, that is nifty. So we're just kind of like sitting in the bus and looking at all this purple. The kids already went to bed because like I said, we got up super early this morning. And so I think like all the excitement and stuff, they crashed. You want to show them a tour? Show them a tour. So in here, we have our kitchen that we are going to completely remodel. We think we're going to do like a dinette here, extend the kitchen out a little bit, go with a smaller sink, two burner stove top. This is going to come out and go on the outside of the bus. Everything in here, we could literally use it as is. We don't have to do anything. We just want to do some certain things aesthetic wise. Like, and to like make it ours. Yeah, like get rid of the purple. Like I love the purple. I, I think it's really cool. It just, I don't think I want to see it every day. I just want it to be very bright and the, get rid of the black too. So we have a regular, I guess this is like a standard apartment fridge. Mm -hmm. Microwave. This is like a little cabinet that they built. We're gonna take this out, do something completely different. Here it is as well. cool though, because there's a spice rack. Yeah, they did a spice rack, so that's really cool. We might actually keep that just because it's already there and integrate it somewhere else on the bus, probably next to the fridge or something. Uh, over here we have our shower. One of the things that we really liked about this bus was that it actually has a bath. Yeah. The kids cannot go without a bath, so that was like a, a deal breaker right there. Or a, not a deal breaker, a that was the deal maker right there. <laughs> and it's so deep. Like, Garrick and I got in there and we can both fit. Yeah, it's pretty cool. And then on the other side, we have the bathroom. Purple, purple sink. Yeah, we want to do a, this. What we love about this is that they did leave um, a, a window in here. So that's awesome. There's two AC units. So, well, and heater, right? What's it called? A split unit? Yeah, we have two of them. One in the front, one in the back. And then we have four bunks with three kids. We think we're going to turn one of these into like a playroom kind of thing. We're going to add storage to each like a bigger cabinet to each bunk so the kids can have some more space to hold their toys and then i'm also going to build um this is going to lift up and i'm going to have storage underneath the bed because there's a lot of space right here this is like a ton of space that you can use yeah the kids already love this space though like yeah they're obsessed with it already i'm also going to put like a little wall here and a little wall here and then they're going to have like a little rock climbing thing to be able to get up and then we have skylight this lets in a lot of natural light during the day it's even like it's getting dark out it's letting light in right now and then these are just like the storage that they added we want to put like actual cabinets up here so those are going to come down and then we're obviously just from here on out we're just going to be adding our own little touches here and there decorating painting so this actually comes down and gets out of the way which is really cool this is where we're going to build most of the kitchen right here though but i'm actually going to take this entire bracket set and move it to the outside of the bus so we'll have an outside table yeah that'll be nice there's and also then, an outside shower which yes, i love that is also very cool uh, we have a sound system here it comes down tv smart tv there smart tv in the back for the kids i can't wait to show you guys what it looks like when we are finished with it also if you want to come to the outside of the bus on this side of the bus we have our spot for the generator. This this kind of holds our holds. Hot, this holds our hot water tank. <laughs> this is our outdoor shower. We have an extra gas tank for our generator. Um, and then we have this awning that comes out, and it has oh yeah, that's it has really LED cool. LED lighting right there, and that is something that we really like because we can kind of just like hang out underneath there, get get a get to get a little bit of shade. <laughs> we want to get rid of literally all the purple just because I love the purple and I, purple is one of my favorite colors, but it's just I don't not... mind keeping it on the outside. I just meant the inside to like brighten it up. No, I want the whole aesthetic to stay the same. Okay. So I don't know what color we're going to do this yet, but maybe it'll just be black. Maybe it'll be another color. We don't know yet. I think we ended up finding the perfect size bus for us. For sure. It's not too big, not too small. She got a, she got a 24 valve turbo diesel Cummins. <laughs> Best engine you can ever have. We're basically just riding out the end of the world at this point. We got ourselves a tank. We ready to go. <laughs> I am really excited. Me too. This is going to be a lot of new adventures for us in I here. I know. I'm so excited. This bus means more to us than anything materialistic. This means traveling, adventures, and just being somewhat nomadic for a little while. Being intentional with our family. Being more purposeful and showing our kids there's there's more to the world. Also just increasing consciousness in not only our kids, but in us that there's there's more to this earth than our daily routines and decreasing our sensory overloads and minimizing our life for a little while. Ultimately, we just wanna live life to the fullest and experience what the world has to offer. And we're excited to share this journey with you guys.